What's up everybody? This is Giovanni from the Options Trading Channel. Been watching the markets all gosh darn day. And we're just now starting to get a uh, signal here. Looking at trading at the, at the uh, 255 calls, seven days out. 255 calls are so expensive. Let's see if uh, the Qs, let's see the Qs maybe trading the 186, anywhere above 186, 187, 187.50s, 187. 50s. I like the 187.50s. We'll see what uh, happens. Let's see if the queues can close above that upper MOBO band uh, that'll trigger a buy order. Alrighty guys, we're getting a signal on the queues here. I'm getting ready to buy two of the 187.50 calls that expire in seven days. Market order, I'm going to do two. So got five minutes until candle closes. I think it's gonna close. Let's see, we're gonna do a limit order at 8.50. See if I can get filled in there. <clears throat> the 87.50 calls that expire in seven days. That's me on the bid at 8.50. And it looks like I got in. Got in at 8.50. Uh, we're going to go to two positions. I'm going to close just one. And for demonstration purposes, this is what I'm doing. I bought at 850. I need to find out what my 10% target is. Times point 10, 85 cents plus 850. 9.35. So I'm going to put in a limit order at 9.35 for one. It's a limit. Send send order we are good there about 28 dollars on the day let's hope for the best i trust my strategy even if this is a bad um trade a bad signal it's okay it's absolutely okay put in my uh, 10 percent order in there it's going in the right direction so far 853 by 880 about 32 dollars so far uh, 38 and climbing let's see if uh i don't know maybe i can get filled today no way we're gonna get filled already no way we still got 30 minutes left into uh, uh until the closing bell it's going up everything is switching to the upside What's up everybody? This is Giovanni from the Options Trading Channel and I'm here to report, sadly, this was my biggest loser ever. I lost 35% um, of basically my entire trading account that I spent so long the last three months, um, almost, you know, full three months, three and a half months. Uh, building it, I had it up to 80%. Now I'm back down to 30%. I'm still in the green from when I started at the beginning of the year. I'm still in the green by $300. Uh, but again, my worst nightmare happened, which was getting in. And the moment I get in, it just tanks. The market tanks. It's not so much my strategy. It, it, nothing could have predicted that move. Everything seemed like it was in place. In fact, I was um, up. I was... I thought that I was going to actually get out, you know, with my 10% gain for half of my position. Um, you know, as soon as I bought in, it was going in my direction, but it, something spooked the markets yesterday. I don't know. Um, I tried looking everywhere to see, you know, if something happened and in my personal opinion, I don't know. I I'm not usually the one that like points fingers or tries to make so much sense out of it because the, the market itself is, is chaotic. It's chaos. Um, I think the fact that the coronavirus uh, hit hard uh, in the United States, I think now we have more cases than anybody else in the world um, that's been tossed around. And, and I think that's what spooked the markets. I have no idea. Um, there's nothing wrong uh, with my strategy. I, I'm not changing a single thing from my strategy. 
the one thing that I can do is um, it, it's about money management, I guess. We'll start, I'll start there. It's about money management. And I was trading with basically 90% of my entire portfolio. That's a big no-no. If you want to survive in these markets, you got to take those hits and be safe. Uh, taking those hits because that's the inevitable. It's the inevitable that we're going to lose. We're going to have losing trades. We're going to have uh, bad trades. It's just a fact of trading the stock market. You can't be right every time. It's just not realistic. So it's okay. I'm okay. I'm still here. I'm not, um, you know, sure that's, that's quite the hit hits, but you know, I'll recover. I'll recover, recover from it, from it eventually. Um, at least I hope, <laughs> but anyways, I, I want to be as, as transparent as I possibly can with all my trades with my channel. This is what I'm here for. I'm not here to show you the big Lambo, uh, in the background, my big mansion for crying out loud. That's not me. Um, but I just want to show every trade that I possibly can every trade that I make, whether it's a good one or a bad one guys. And unfortunately this was a bad one. This was my biggest, um, losing trade. I lost over $500. Um, uh, but Hey, it is what it is. And life goes on. See you here again on the very next trade, hoping that I can start recovering the $500 that I lost, uh, basically yesterday guys. So thank you so much. Hit that subscribe button down below comment. Also what you made money on, what you lost money on. And let's see if we can help each other out, guys. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching. See you here again on the very next trading video. Bye.